guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm your host, Gear Hook Girl, and today we're going to be showing you how to replace your worn out Rackin and tie rod ends with brand new, freshy fresh ones. So the first step in replacing your tie rod and steering rack end is taking the appropriate measurement. So you want to go ahead and remove your old one and then measure from right here down to the center over here. In this case it's looking like 40 for us and then you want to adjust the new one to match. And then in this case our boots are a little bit different so we're going to be taking this apart and taking that one apart to slide this on top of that one. Alright, so we've got our tie rod end separated from our rack end. Okay, and in this case we're just going to be moving this. Slide this boot off. There we go. Alright, so we'll take this boot and we will carefully slide on our boot. Let's go ahead and put our nut back on. Then we're going to put this on with the taper facing up. And then we'll go ahead and get our tie rod in and screw that in to the length that we've measured. So for us it's going to be 40, so we're about there. So we'll just lock that in place. So you've got a 21 and a 22, we're just going to tighten that down. Once you tighten it, double check the measurement again. And you can go ahead and install it in the car. You can have your buddy hold the washer in place. And we'll go ahead and try to get a lot threaded in that leg. Alright, so once you've got it threaded in, you can take your tool and go ahead and tighten it down. Now, once you've got that all nice and tightened up, you can take your screwdriver and your hammer and you're going to bend down this retaining clip to hold on to that. Alright, so that'll keep it from turning. Right, and then you can slide your boot on. I'll get a zip tie and install that there. Alright, so you got your zip tie. So you go ahead and just tighten that down and trim it. And then you can see you've got our nice zip tie installed. Alright, so now we're just going to turn this back around this way. And get this up in here. Slide that through. You can see the top there. Get our nut and we'll wind that on. Get our 17 millimeter socket and tighten it down. So now you've installed your brand new tie rod in and rack end and you just reinstall that wheel, drop the car down and take it to your nearest alignment shop. Alright guys and gals, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please hit like and subscribe and I'll catch you guys back in the next one. See ya. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and like and comment if you enjoyed this video. If you want to be awesome and provide support for better content, click on the Patreon link in the description below. Check us out online at gearheadgirl69.com or ghg69.com or follow us on Instagram and TikTok at gearheadgirl69.